same time. Just want to talk about some notations just for a little bit. Music notations today, just a little bit. Um, you know, I've been having a lot of questions about reading music, so just a little basic for today. Just a little basic. Um, first thing we're going to talk about is the whole note. And the whole note looks like this. Right there, like that. And that equals four counts. All right, we're going to put a whole note here, though. You can say it equals four beats. Uh, I'll put it right up under the bottom so you can see. One, two, three, four. I'm putting one over there. I'll explain the one a little later if I can get to it. Um, but the whole note equals four, uh, four counts or four beats. So it'd be like one, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. So it's continuous. So with the whole note, if you break it, break it down or bust it in half, you get, you get what you get, uh, get what you call half notes. Half notes. Right there. Half notes. And those equal two beats. Two beats, so you get one, two, and one, two. But in, in uh, meter form, it'd be one, Two, three, four. So two of these equal the whole. It's actually going to be a pyramid. And you'll see how the pyramid grows. So these are called half notes. So one, two, three, four. Two half notes equal a whole. All right. So the next tier after that would be what you call the quarter notes. Quarter notes, and there are these right here like this. And hopefully you can see the pyramid growing. So, and then counting wise, you have one, beat one, beat two, beat three, and beat four. Hopefully you can see that. So, two quarter notes equal one half note. So you see it? One, two, three, four. And these are quarters. So, in other words, if we were in measure form, if we were in measure form, also, I got to, you know, also have to say this as well. For every note, there's a rest as well. So, you have a whole rest, and you have a half note rest, and you have quarter rest. All right, so, uh, for this sake right now, let's look at a quarter. A quarter note rest is going to look like that. Look like a, 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 a weird three, if I can say it like that. So, I'm going to build the measure real quick. We'll talk about that a little later. And I'm building measure four four, and I'll explain all this four four stuff a little later. We in four four. Let's do some counting real quick. So we have. This is based off of quarter notes because of the four, but I'll talk about that. Um, you have one, two. Let's put a rest here, like that. So if we were counting this, right here. And let's look at the beats. One, two, three, four. Let's look at the beats like that. If we're looking at it, you'll have the temples right there like that. You'll have one, two, rest, four. You see it? Let me keep the tempo. I'll keep the tempo with this. So you have one, um, one, two, ready. And you have one, two, three, four. I'll clap it out. One, Two, ready, and you have one, two, three, four. All right, let's do another one. Let's look at another one. Let's look at, let's do, let's look at that like that. So tempo wise right here, right there. So you have one, two, ready, and rest, two, three, four. Let me put the count so you can see it. So you have one, two, three, four. So count it again. One, two, ready. And one, two, three, four. Rest, two, three, four. I hope that makes sense. We'll do one more. 
so you can actually see it. And remember, this is a rest, the little, the little funky looking three. Um, let's do one like this here. Let's look at that. One, let me put the count up under so you can see. Let's look at the count. So you have one, two, ready, and rest, two, three, four. See it? Rest, two, three, four. I hope that making sense to you. I'll do one more, then we'll move on down to the eighth notes. Let's look at this one here like this. So we're just talking about some music notation because you're getting some questions and you need to know what you're playing, if that makes sense. All right? All right, let's look at this. Let's count this. One, two, ready, and we got one, two, three, four. Sorry. Let me put the count again so you can see. That makes sense. So do it again. One, two, ready, and one, rest, rest, four. Hope that makes sense to you. All right, let's shift on down. This ain't going to be long. I wanted to kind of get to 16 note, but we might stop at 8, but we'll see. So we have quarter notes. When you break a quarter note down in, or in half, you get what you call eighth notes. An eighth note could look several different ways. Let's look at some eighth notes before I draw it out. A single eighth note can look like that. The difference between the eighth note and the quarter note is a flag. It has a flag on it. So another way eighth notes can look, you can they can be they can be jointly together. They can be like this. They can be connected. So the only thing you, you know we've done, we've taken the flag here and just connect, connect them together. So eighth notes can look like that. And also they can be grouped in fours. So it can be single, grouped in twos, grouped in fours. You can see them connected like this. Seem grouped that way like that. And the only difference between the eighth note and the quarter note, physically looking at it, is the flag. All right, so let's look at them right here. One. We're going to tie these together by groups of two so you can actually see the beat. And I cannot see none of your comments. So I'll go back and look at them if you're commenting. All right, so, and these are eight notes. These are eight notes. So you're gonna have one and two and three and four and. So look at the big beats back from the quarter notes. One, two, three, Four. These are grouped in, the, in, the, in, in those big beat frames. One, two, three, four. So you just got, I, I call it filling. So you got a little bit more extra filling in the back. So you got one and two and three and four. And. So everything's within that beat. Hopefully you can see it. One, you know, that's the one frame. One, two, I hope this is making sense to you. So one and two and three and four. And. All right, and those are eighth notes. Now, let's do some quarter note and eighth note together. Looking at it. Let's try to count them out real quick. So you can see, I'll leave the diagram up so you can see. Hopefully you can see it, hopefully I'm not too low. Um, make my little house. So let's put a, let's do like that. Might be crooked. I feel like I'm right lopsided. 
No, I don't want to get too busy with it. Let's make it like this. Let's keep it full form. Full form. All right, so looking at the beat, you know, looking at, looking at the beats, you got beat one, there's beat two. So look, let's break it down like this so you can see it. That's beat one, this, this, the, this beat two, so you got two and, there's beat three, and here's beat four. Hope you can see that. Beat one, two frame, three frame, four frame. So counting that out, going slow. One, two, ready and go, and one, two, and three, four. Hope you can see it. One, two, and three, four. I counted, I didn't play that. Let me do, let me do it again. One, two, and three, four. All right, one more time. One, two, ready, and one, two, and three, four. Let's look at another one. Reading music. We want y'all to know what y'all playing and stuff like that. Hopefully this is helping you. And you can see the big beats. One, two, three, four. And how, and how the uh, notes link up and stuff together like that. Let's look at another one. Let's look at that one. Let's, let's write, write it out. One and two, three, four. Similar to the last one. A couple of things changed though. Here we go, ready?